Cabinet has this afternoon reviewed the current alert levels. Based on our usual criteria, the Director General of Health has recommended to Cabinet, and Cabinet has agreed, that as of midnight tonight, Auckland will drop down to alert level 2. The decision to change the alert level settings for Auckland comes despite three new community cases of COVID-19 reported today. The rest of the country will enter alert level 1. However, Papatoi Toi High School will be an exception to the alert level changes. Every student will have had to have had at least one negative test result, remembering that the testing for the students started from day five after the exposure event, which was last Wednesday, so that's reassuring. So we're quite comfortable with all the negative test results we have. Anyone who develops symptoms or who wants a second test can do so over the weekend. Pacific clinician Dr Apitalia Maitonga says the move by cabinets was to be expected. It shows that we have, uh, this is a contained outbreak. Uh, yes, we've had some new cases today, but they're all connected. And as Dr. Bloomfield said, they're all linked epidemiologically so we can track and trace uh, how the virus has spread. Another Pacific clinician, Dr. Colin Tsukui-Tonga, believes an extension of alerts level 3 for Auckland may have been more ideal. The issue in this case, it appears to be the right thing to do because we don't know where this has all come from. Uh, and if you're not sure of the source, and I understand the genome sequencing doesn't connect it to any of the MIQ cases, so there's a big question mark about the source of it. Apitalia Maitonga urges the Papatoetoe community to continue to be vigilant as they have over the past few days. And a real shout out to Papatoetoe High School and the community and the Pacific community. You know, thank you for coming forward and getting tested. But a word of caution, uh, this is not uh, a license to go out and party. With us going to level two, we still need to remain vigilant and be careful going out. For the Papatoetoe community, the testing site at their local high school will remain open over the coming days. Elijah Farfew, PMN News.